Uh, popular question, I think Karun and Semyat were just asking me about it, or we were just talking about this one. This is a loanable funds market here. Uh, remember, the loanable funds market is made up of two people. The people that demand loans, they are going to be your borrowers. The people that supply loans to the banks, or supply dollars to the banks for loaning, those people are the people that are saving here. Now, one of the popular scenarios that they give you is the government is going to mess with some stuff here. Uh, and one of the possible scenarios is a budget deficit here. And a budget deficit, hopefully, if you didn't read behind me, now I'm standing in the way, uh, is what? When the government is spending beyond what they are bringing in. And so if you spend more than you are bringing in, some things have to happen here. Uh, and this is, can be kind of tricky on the test. They will normally try to be very specific, and they'll tell you to move the supply curve or the demand curve. Uh, if they don't, then they in the past have accepted full uh, possibilities here. You can think of it like, oh, well, if the government is spending more than they are bringing in, then they're going to need some extra dollars, so what's going to happen over here? We could say, oh, we'll move our demand curve to the right. And you notice what happened to the real interest rate. I'm being lazy. Uh, oh, yeah, I'm lazy. Uh, it went up, right? Uh, you can also do this. It can be shown. Instead of moving your demand curve to the right, you move your supply curve to the left. And you notice the same same end result, that you get a higher real interest rate. Uh, one of the things about the labeling here is sometimes it's hard for kids to remember. Is this real interest rate or nominal? Read the question. It will tell you. Okay? It will say, tell us what happens to the real interest rate. Or when this happens, what happens to the real interest rate? Use the information they give you. Okay? Don't mess this up. Uh, but then what they're going to ask you, what's the consequence of this? And they're probably going to ask about economic growth in the long run over time. Higher interest rate is going to mean what? What will people do if the interest rate is higher? Or maybe what's important is what they won't do. You, do you know? They will not. Uh, you will see investment in things like capital goods. Fall. And if you don't have capital goods, what's going to happen to the growth rate of your country? What is a capital good? A machine? Sure. That's a capital good. A tool? Oh, yeah. Things that make things? If you don't have things that make things, what's going to happen to the growth in your country? It's down. Okay. I like this new gadget thing. I actually kind of like that I get to look at myself. I look dang good today. All right. Good night, sleep. Come to breakfast in the morning. Give me, uh, Let me know if you have any questions. Facebook me. Email me. Whatever you got to do. Make it happen.